have been appealing to the public of Barbados since November when we had our kettle launch. Our launch, our launch started off in early November with a t and we targeted um, $700,000, which would enable us to carry on the work that we do. We, during that time, November and December, we made many appeals to the public. And um, I'm just happy to say today that we're here to thank all the members of the Salvation Army who has worked tediously to get the kettles out and to get the envelopes, mailing envelopes out. So I want to thank them. But more particularly, the people of Barbados for coming out and giving us really, really good support. We had good support last year. We had COVID and we had good support. This year we had COVID still with us. It was even better. Our target of $700,000 was, was surpassed this year. And we, I'm happy to say that we reached a total of $817,000 $671.65. That's an increase of about 16, 15, 16, a 16, little over 15 or 16 <clears> percent. <throat> um, a lot of this, these funds will go towards um, helping the less fortunate as we have been doing all the years in the past. But as you know, the Salvation Army has been under a tremendous amount of strain. More people have been coming for assistance and we're happy to assist them once we get the support from the public. And thanks again to the people of Barbados and to the business community who have assisted us. We really appreciate it. What I can tell you that during 2021, we were able <clears throat> to help the following people. With clothing and furniture, we've helped 752 persons for, with furniture and clothing. In food hampers, this is not the Christmas hamper. Food hampers for people that needed, required food, especially during COVID, people that came in with f children and, and, and had no, no meals to get or anything like this. We were happy to say that we gave out 4,987 food hampers. On top of that, the, the regular Christmas hampers, uh, we gave out across Barbados 4,002 persons receive hampers. So all in all, it's nearly, it's just over 9,000, just about 9,000 people receiving hampers by way of during the year and by the Christmas hampers. The feeding center prepared hot meals and indoor meals. When I say indoor, we have changed our system where people come and collect it and leave. In, in. <clears throat> they received 26,480 persons receive meals. And on wheels, which is for shut-ins, we sent out 10,653 so meals. So altogether, we've had a total of 37,133 persons receiving hot meals during 2021. I can only say that we are happy to have done what we have done, and I can only say that this could not have been done without the support of the people and the public of Barbados and the business community. And from all of us at Salvation Army, the advisory board, and of course, Major Brenda Greenwich and Shoma Evelyn, our business manager, we all send out our appreciation and thank the people of Barbados for their kind support and look forward to working with them continuously as we help the people who are less fortunate. Thank you.